Hello and welcome back to another video guys. If you're new to my channel, don't forget to hit the subscribe button for notifications when I've done another video. All my videos are about slow living, sustainability, low waste and mamahood. Today I'm going to be sharing with you how I make my cloth white what recipe I use. Recipe? I'm not cooking wipes, <laughs> but the solution that I keep them in basically and how we use them on a day-to-day -day basis. I hope you enjoy this video. Give it a thumbs up if it's something that you're interested in and I am gonna go and get all the things I need ready to show you. Okay, so I've already boiled the kettle. I'm gonna go ahead and fill this bowl around about a third full. Just enough to basically sit my wipes in. Then I'm gonna get a teaspoon. Uh, that is not a teaspoon. This is a tablespoon. And I'm going to get a nice tablespoon of coconut oil. Make sure that it's your organic raw coconut. This is the one we use. I just get this one off Amazon. I like it because it's in a massive jar and I know I've used it this jar afterwards. And this has lasted just like so long at the minute. So I'm just gonna dissolve that in the water. The oil always seems to float to the top. So when I'm ready to put the cloths in, I like to give it a quick stir and dunk them in. And I'm going to go ahead and put in literally one drop of lavender essential oil. There we go. You want, literally only want one drop. Okay, I can bring you back up here. I've literally just realized that the washing machine has been on, but you're in a family home, guys. <laughs> But I have paused it now, so hopefully you can hear me okay. So I just wanted to show you my wipes that we use. Hopefully this... Um, so these were literally just offcuts of fabric and my mum just hemmed them around the edges. I have got other ones. I'll show you. These are like our secondary lot and you can see they're a lot scruffier around the edges because they have not been hemmed yet, but that's okay. They still do the job and they're just a little bit frayed, but hey, I'm not complaining, they still work. These are more a video appropriate. <laughs> We've got loads of these, um, half of them in the wash at the minute as well. I've experimented with a lot of different fabrics. There's Lavella knocking at the door. <laughs> She's playing outside. So I remember seeing a recommendation that fleece was really good. I tried that. There wasn't for us enough, because it was too soft, there wasn't enough like grip, <laughs> if that makes sense. And then I've used um, other fabrics like cotton and that that was too much grip, that didn't slide enough. <laughs> so you need the correct ratio of grip and slide. <laughs> and so my favorite has to be old used flannelette. You know like when you get them soft flannelette fitted sheets, if you have any old ones of them or a pair of old pyjama bottoms, I think these my mum said were an old pair of pyjama bottoms, these ones that I use were an old pair of pyjama bottoms but it's the same thing as an old fitted sheet of flannelette, it seems to be the perfect combination. They're soft on baby and they wash really well, they hold their shape, so I'm going to go ahead and pop them in the bowl. You saw how quick and easy it was. I'm just gonna pop them all in and just give them a little stir about. And that is it. Nice and ready. They've got a nice slight smell to them. They've been coated with a little bit of coconut oil, which is gonna be lovely and soft. I've said this in other videos, guys, but coconut oil is really great because it's an antifungal as well. And because it is natural, it's obviously safe on baby's bum and cloth nappies as well. Why do I do it in a bowl and not a different method? Because I've tried. <laughs> I've tried lots of different methods, guys. I use a jar like this. I've got a jar like this, an empty one. I'll go and get it in a minute. I've tried popping the cloth nappies at the bottom, pouring the water on the coconut 
oil that doesn't seem to work the coconut oil doesn't melt properly and then you end up with like chunks on the cloth nappies i've tried pouring the hot water in the jar first and then letting the coconut oil melt in the bottom then putting the cloths on top that doesn't work because you only get a few of the cloth wipes coated in too much coconut oil so the best way to do it is to do the mixture in the bowl wait till it's melted get your cloth wipes in give it a good mix about so that they're all coated evenly so it's evenly distributed the oil it's not too much not too little and then i can go ahead depending on if i've got time they will get folded in nicely or they will just get plonked in like that <laughs> i'm gonna go and get the jar now pop them in there if your water is still really really hot and the steam coming out um just leave the lid open for a couple minutes until the steam stopped and then you can close them you want to make sure you use a nice airtight container for them obviously this is really great this is working for us around the house it's really convenient if you run out you saw how quick and easy that was to make some more you might be thinking well well that's all well and good in the house but what about when you're out and about well we use another little container i've kept this pot it's a great size it's a great travel size and i just fill them up with our cloth wipes and that goes in the baby bag i mean it's really not rocket science disposable wet wipes are just so bad for the environment they're either going to be in the landfills or in the oceans and they they're just they're just not great and a lot of them have chemicals in they're coming in plastic they're always going to be wrapped in plastic even like your eco-friendly wipes although i don't believe that that fully exists this is just zero waste option and it's just so kind on your baby's bum as well it's just an all-round winner in our house if you're a parent and you're looking to be more sustainable you're looking to be more low waste i would say start with cloth nappies and cloth wipes because they are your biggest waste product aren't they with the baby and um obviously if you've been following our other videos we do cloth nappy i will drop my cloth nappy in playlist here if you're new to cloth nappies check that out got loads of information there <laughs> Let me make a video. She's making your wipes. In the camera. <laughs> in the camera. Medicine. Yeah, well, it's not medicine, it's your cloths. See, when these are done, these go in our dirty cloth nappy bin and they go in the wash along with the cloth nappy. So I hope you enjoyed this video, guys. Give it a thumbs up. Feel free to subscribe if you want more videos like this and any video suggestions, drop them in the comments below. Say bye-bye. Go, girl. See you in the next video, guys.